indeed. We made it this far by grace. If you love that music, you, I'm sure you'd be excited to know that uh, Reverend Pastor Edwin Dadson is here in our studios this morning and he's here with Andrew Adiete, who's the concert coordinator, as this far by grace, the concert is nigh. So we'll be discussing that and getting into a bit of gospel music here. So Pastor Edwin Dadson, you're welcome. It's so a new day. You. And Andrew, Andrew Adiete, you're also welcome to New Day. How is it going? Uh, this far by grace. Hallelujah. <laughs> so far, so we've come this far by awesome. grace. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Let's let's get uh, into the concert. Mm. You've been you know blessing lives with your music uh, for quite some time now. Mm. So why would you shift into the concert this far by grace? Uh, so would you take that? Why yeah, did you shift I, into I, this concert? I mean, we we by the grace of God, mm -hmm. um, we did this last year. And this year too, we want to come again um, to be a blessing to people. Mm. We feel the statement this far by grace is something everybody would want to say yeah. to God. So I thought that, okay, what if we could put it in music, yeah. you know, and by the grace of God, all over the country and beyond this place, people are, are saying the same thing. Mm. And so we want to stage this concert and come with a gratitude heart and give thanks to God for January all the way to November and even to December as yeah. we cross over. over. For some of you, it's not just January, it's what you've gone through, exactly. how far the Lord has brought you. That's why we want to just put this concert together. This yeah. And besides, we also want to use this opportunity to raise funds for okay. children with heart disease with a oh. Little Heart Foundation. Oh, okay. So this year, that's our focus. Oh, okay, with Little Heart Foundation. Mm. I want to know though, Ajayate, why did you select, uh, you know, why did you choose to help those with um, heart, heart issues? So, um, thank you. Um, we realized that, um, I mean, if you look at Ghana, and we say that um, a vast, proportion of our population, we are Christians. Mm. Um, helping um, people who have need is the call of the church. Mm. So we are thinking if we worship God, lift our hands to God, obviously he should put something in our hands that when we come down, we give to people. Mm. And so um, Pastor Datsun thought that we should look at children who have heart problems. And okay. the reason is also because um, Little Hearts Foundation since 2014 has been helping a lot of kids. Oh, okay. okay, well about 40 to 60 children who wow. have been helped. Okay, um, in what um, ways? Mm -hmm. So um, um, children have problems. They are we are not in Ghana. They are not able to detect when the child has a heart problem when the mother ha is pregnant. Okay, so you ha you give birth, and then now oh, they will yes. realize that. You, you, your child has a heart problem. Imagine right. if you gave birth and you were told that the condition of your, your child's heart okay, has to be figured out or has to be resolved in one year. Mm -mm. And the figure is ranging from a CD equivalent of $1,800 to mm. $8,000. Yeah, and you are not prepared for money. it. So when yeah. mothers are not able to afford this or parents are not able to afford this, they lose their children. You are living with a child you know is going to die, mm. but you are looking up. So we thought that, why don't we step in and then call, um, give the wake up call. Let's okay. help um, um, the Little Hearts, the Little Hearts Foundation there. to support um, the children with heart problems in Ghana. Thank okay. you. Yes. Interesting. So out of all of the projects that you could have funded or mm. you could have helped out, you chose the Little Hearts. Mm. Okay. Um, what, what project did you work on last year? Last year we didn't, we didn't do any okay. project. All right, but you, how long has the concert been running for? Um, we started the This Far concert last year. Okay, but there have been other concerts as well. Um, that was 2014, my oh, first concert. Oh, wow. The Wiyo Yes, you oh, yeah. that song, it always just blesses me. Mm. Oh, right, 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 okay. Now, I'm going to switch a little bit, so, yeah. Pastor. Yeah. What, how do you see gospel music in Ghana today? Do you think that our artists are trying? Do you think that they're actually doing what gospel artists should be doing? Do you think it's real gospel music or do you think we are straying off course? No, I think we are on course. Okay. I mean, um, we can we can speak about this the whole day, mm. but let's just use a few minutes to address it. I think Ghanaian gospel musicians are doing very well. Okay. Our problem is we just don't, 
we, we just don't appreciate ourselves. Uh, we mm. have the spirit of devaluation and degradation. We just beat down anything that is Ghanaian. Right. But truly, I mean, uh, if you go out there, uh, boot for boot, you look at our composition, you look at our mixing. Yes. I mean, you compare Ghanaian mix with Nigerian mix, yeah. it's not close. You know, even sometimes um, South African mix, I could say it's okay, but we are really on. Oh, Ghanaian Ghana is better. Ghanaian mix is good. The Ghan final music. I'm telling you. Oh, wow. I'm telling you. You know, um, by the grace of God, He's raising people to give us. Mix is a lot when it comes to That's no matter true. how good you've sung a That's song. That's true. In terms of the artistry, I think people are rising. There are people that God is raising, mm. you know, after the Neo Kinds and after the, the Dannys, and, and they are really coming with full speed, yeah. you know. And so I think we are doing well. We just need support yeah we need strategy okay. you know and i believe we are getting into the season where ghana music will be out there like mm. we i don't i used to be down you know i used to be one of the people who bash nigerian music is taking over blah, blah, blah. Yeah. I, I think wisdom has taught me that look just wait for your time learn what they are doing mm -hmm. and position yourself for what god is about to do because exactly. when it gets to our time and people must hear our music all over the world people should sing our songs and people should start digging for Ghanaian yeah, songs. So we can't yes. still be there complaining and comparing exactly. you ourselves. Have to do something so, about it. so we are positioning ourselves, and uh, we will get there. Mm. I, I believe we will get there. That's we good are, to we'll note. Yes, you also mentioned we have um, we have younger people who are coming up sure. fast and all of that. You have any of them on the bill for this year's concert? Yes, um, um, I'll be doing again a mic toss in, in in this year's concert, and I'll be featuring some of the. Uh, and unknown musicians, uh, oh sorry, singers who are coming up, uh, and uh, I would like people to come and hear them. Okay. Um, it would be very wonderful. Okay. Any names that you can drop? Oh, I have Philip Ajali, I have Pastor okay. Ella, mm. I have Sisi Beidu. Mm. Um, these guys are there, but they are not well known. Okay. But they are okay. so gifted, and Ooh. I believe. God is raising them up. Amen seriously. to that. Yeah. Amen. So when is this concert happening? Sunday. This just the Sunday. This Sunday. Okay, two days away. Mm -hmm. Okay, what time? Um, Sunday 17th, 3 p.m. for 3 the praise party, outdoor praise party with wow. soul winners. Okay. And then 4.30 we begin the, the main event, event in the auditorium of Harvest Chapel. Harvest Chapel. Yeah. Where is that located? Um, near Abeka Total filling station it's south south tesano okay okay yeah. okay all right um mm -hmm. so it's happening just this su 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 sunday yes okay at um harvest, harvest chapel. chapel international yes the time is 3 p.m yes, for please. the praise party and then from four we zoom into the main Shop. events for the day okay um any other thing that we need to know is it for free no it's not for free i'm sure anybody who is watching would not want to come to such a concert for oh. free because we want to support children with heart problems so okay um we have tickets going for sale um mm -hmm. single tickets 30 cities okay and double is 50 cities and the vip is 100 cities okay for anybody who is watching right now you will want to take an advantage or take and this opportunity yeah. of buying tickets just using your phone by dialing the code if you use MTN dial star seven one three star five star sixteen hash star seven one three star five star sixteen hash okay. or for other networks just call zero two seven three one hundred five five seven zero two seven three one hundred five five seven that's it and you will be in all right and i want us to end with um the notes on the fact that you are supporting the little hearts foundation mm -hmm. so any one of you can take it speak to um, the public and let them know why they should actually be at your event on sunday i i, I want to invite everyone to this far by grace concert um, because we want to support children with heart disease we want to help them currently as i speak there is one who is just who is our main target, they are just waiting for something to come out of this project so they can just fly this child to India and go and help this child. She's called Vanessa and uh, I pray that, I'm trusting God for healing, but I believe that God would use a process, healing is a process so we can raise money and help doctors to make this happen. So come and support. Anything you would give 
would support this course and God will bless you. God will bless you in so many ways. Get ready for next year. I mean, God will do mighty things through you. So let down, let, let, lay down a sacrifice, a seed of sacrifice that will live, will live next year to speak on your behalf. We'll see you, God willing, on Sunday. Uh, this far by grace concept. Amen. It says, there's a saying that he who gives receives as well. And so as you come and you are giving out, you also be receiving your blessings in the presence of God. And so thank you so much. I'm sure we will join you on, I will be there anyway, on Sunday to praise and worship and to enjoy your new music as well, seeing as you'll be launching some new songs yeah, we'll as you normally do. Exactly. So it's happening uh, this Sunday. You don't want to miss out on it. Thank you so much for joining us, Pastor Dadson and Andrew Ajete here on New Day. It's been a great one. We